popular apparel brand Zara's Spanish owner Inditex has shut down 3,785 stores worldwide amid the COVID-19 outbreak. Inditex warned that its operations have faced a very significant impact due to the pandemic. It said it has been forced to shut down in 39 markets, according to a report by Metro. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, in his address to the nation on Friday, launched a COVID-19 economic response task force that will be headed by Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman. He said the task force would ensure that all necessary steps were taken to reduce the economic difficulties arising out of the crisis that the country was facing due to coronavirus. He also urged the FM-led task force to implement them effectively. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal has reacted to the hanging of the Nirbhaya rape case culprits which took place on early Friday morning. Kejriwal, in his statement, has asked the people of India to take a resolution that they won't let another case like Nirbhaya happen ever again. Kejriwal also listed out weakness in the police system and the judicial system. He said that everyone needs to work together to sort out these weaknesses and make things better. Amazon closed a small New York City warehouse temporarily after one of its associates tested positive for the coronavirus, a move that highlights the operational risk it faces as the disease spreads. The company said it has sent associates home from the delivery station with full pay as it sanitizes the facility. India watched Prime Minister Narendra Modi's speech on coronavirus yesterday with much anticipation. In his speech, the Prime Minister also talked about how India can fight coronavirus, urged people to practice social distancing and to keep indoors unless it is of extreme importance. Industry leaders such as Tech Mahindra CEO and MD CP Gurnani and Biocon Chairperson and Managing Director Kiran Majumdar Shaw believe that the speech showed all seriousness and intent.